Okay, guys, in this tutorial, let's say your microphone has a low volume. Or let's say your microphone is not working at all. So no input volumes. When you record some things and play the video, you'll see you'll not have any audio in the video. That means your microphone is not working. Your microphone, when you play the video, you'll see very low volume. It's a minimum volume. And sometimes you'll see your microphone is completely uh, it's quiet, no sound at all. So how do you fix all this uh, issue with respect to microphones on Windows 11 or Windows 10? So I'll be showing you this demonstration on Windows 11. You can even follow this tutorial for Windows 10. Few simple easy steps you can follow in this tutorial that might help you fix. If one, sol one solution do not help you, you can try another solutions. One the other solutions might help you guys fix this issue. So very first solutions, we click on this uh, sound like icon and then click on sound settings. So when you click on sound settings, uh, we'll come up with this space. And here you're gonna click on more sound settings. And this page, we're gonna click on recording and here you have a microphones. So we'll select the microphones. And so you can see green tick marks. That is my default microphones working right now. Click on properties. In properties, uh, here you have a level. So you'll increase the microphone level to 100% and or you'll increase it to 80%, 90%, at max 100% and you'll boost it to plus 30 or you can keep it to plus 10, 20 and at max you'll increase it to 30. I will come back to advance and you choose the highest level. Sometimes the highest level might not work for you. So you'll choose a level which is best for you. Uh, and then here you're gonna choose uh, the possible best option that really works for you. So at first uh, try the highest level. If that do not work you, you can come back to the same place and change another. And make sure these two options is checked. So this will enhance. And then here you have, uh, after doing all these things, uh, you're gonna, if you have any kinds of issue with all this, you'll come back and you'll restore the default. So any kinds of PIN apply and click on, uh, again, you're gonna click it yes, and then click on okay. So any issue occurs, you can come back to the same place and change it to default. Again, come back to the properties. So when you'll come back to the properties, you're gonna see over here, uh, Advanced options, you have uh, marks and says in general. You will see that this needs to be enabled. If it is disabled, you guys are going to enable it. And then don't forget to apply and click on OK after enabling it. And here also input volume is good to increase it to 100% uh, if it is uh, low. And here format also, here you can choose uh, at most uh, highest level. You can see over here, so format, uh, possible best option. Even you can uh, start the test. You can uh, speak some things over here and then you're gonna stop it. You can see it is at 2%. So the total volume is only 2%. The input volume out of 100%, it is only taking 2%. That is why your volume is so low. When you play the video, it is at low volume or no sound at all. It's completely quiet. It is not recording at all. Your voice is. So even you can check for the, to update the driver. Sometime updating the driver to the latest person really works. So this is another solution you can try. So you can check for the driver updates in a Windows update and you can update it to the latest persons. So this might uh, help you sometimes. Sometime updating will only cause the problems. So you, before your device was working fine and you have updated your device to the latest person and it is not working. Now again, uh, how do you, you can, in that case, you can roll back your driver to the previous state. You are not roll backing your entire PC, entire, so all the updates, but only the sound driver you are rolling back to the previous state. So you can check for the updates and install the necessary updates. If uh, update has uh, recent update has really caused the problem previously, if it was working fine, what you're gonna do is you can go back.
After going back, again, you have your more sound settings. You're going to click on that. And then here you have a recording, some microphones, go to properties. Here you're going to click on properties again. You come up with this window. So I'm going to click on change settings. Again, you'll come up with another windows and you'll here you'll go to the drivers. Now you'll click on roll back driver. If you want to choose the options, uh, what might be the reason why you want to roll back your driver to the previous state? So you're going to choose one options from there why you want to roll back. So I want to roll back because previously my previous driver was giving the good performance and then click on OK. So it will take some time to so roll back. It's not responding. That means it is uh, working on it. Uh, you can see the LO cursor moving. So roll backing the driver. So give a time to roll back the driver. After roll backing, uh, it is successfully done. You can see. Click on yes. Now you'll restart the PC. After restarting the PC, again you'll come back to the same place and check it back. Go to the sound settings, and now at this time again we'll test the sound. It's working fine. After roll backing the driver, you can see the fluctuation. Some microphone. See the fluctuations. It is taking the input now. The input uh, sound, it's an input voice. Whatever I speak, it is, uh, see, this block shooting is taken. Now I can start the 53% of the total volumes. So the input volume is, uh, it was 2%, now it is 53%. So update has caused the problem. Rollbacking driver really worked for me. So one of the other steps will help you. Now you, you will get the sound in your board, in your video after recording. So if you like this tutorial, be sure to hit the like uh, button, subscribe and comment.